Today, we celebrate the accomplishments and academic achievements of our dear pupils in spite of the challenges brought about by the COVID-19 pandemic. It may not be the usual celebration, but I am certain that this is God's best way of keeping us all safe in these trying times. I strongly believe that this timing is always perfect, even if things do not work out the way we planned. Although this pandemic has really changed everything around the world, still we are blessed because we are here today, able to witness this momentous event of the lives of our graduating class. The long wait is finally over for our parents and their children, for this is the culmination of the many years of hard work in the pursuit of knowledge and marks the beginning of a new milestone for them to prepare in achieving their goals and dreams in life. Ladies and gentlemen, Bao Central Elementary School proudly presents the 41st Virtual Graduation Ceremony for school year 2020-2021 with the theme, Strengthening the Quality of Education Amid the COVID-19 Pandemic. To start with, it is my pleasure to acknowledge the people who made this momentous event possible, for without their support, this could not be realized. To the equally and highly esteemed individuals from the Schools Division Office of Cotabato, headed by the ever-dynamic Schools Division Superintendent, the Sagani S. De La Cruz, Ceso 5, our very active principal in charge, Ma'am Daisy J. Fortinez, our dedicated and very young at heart school principal, Ma'am Ophelia R. Caturas, faculty and staff of Bao Central Elementary School, members of the graduating class, proud parents, guardians, stakeholders, friends, ladies and gentlemen, a pleasant viewing to all. To begin, we may all put ourselves in the spirit of patriotism as we sing the Philippine National Anthem and this will be followed by an oxology, Pananumpa sa Watawat, Regional Hymn and Division Hymn. Sa 
A'udzu billahi minasy syaithanir rajim. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Faqala rabbukum ud'uni astaghfir lakum amin ya rabbal alamin. Alhamdulillahi rabbil alamin arrahmanir rahim maliki yawmiddin. Iyyaka na'budu wa iyyaka nasta'in. Ihdinas siratal mustaqim. Siratal ladzina an'amta 'alaihim ghairil maghdubi 'alaihim waladh dhalin. Amin. Allahumma ajma shamalal muslimin wa kristiyan wa lumad fi madinat Dabab. وسلم دائما مجتمعنا هذا بسلم والأمن والتقدم في بلدنا هذا آمين يا رب العالمين ربنا لا تجيغ قدوبنا بعد جهلتنا وهب لنا من لدنك رحمة إنك أنت الوهاب ربنا إنك أنت الوهاب ربنا تنا في الدنيا حسنة وفي الآخرة حسنة وقنا عذاب النار وصلى الله على خير خلقه سيدنا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه وسلم سبحان ربك رب العزة ما يسيبون وسلام على المرسلين والحمد لله رب العالمين آمين يا رب العالمين In the name of the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, Amen Our most gracious heavenly Father We come to you today to praise and worship you and give you thanks for all the things you continue to provide for ourselves and our families. Father, we humbly ask for forgiveness for all the times we have offended you. When we forget to acknowledge your presence in the image of our brothers and sisters, and for moments we fail to be good stewards of the blessings you have given us. Continue to guide and protect each one of us, Lord, that we may always walk in the light of your everlasting love and mercy. Grant us, Father, with your comfort in times of distress and with your strength in times of weakness. Bestow upon us your unending grace and healing that may, may in turn become instruments of gentleness and compassion to others. We ask all this in the name of your Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, with a prayer and the intercession of our Blessed Mother. Amen. Panunumpa sa watawat ng Pilipinas. Ako ay Pilipino, buong katapatang nanunumpa sa watawat ng Pilipinas at sa bansang kanyang sinasagisag na may dangal, katarungan at kalayaan na pinakikilos ng sambayanang makadyos, makakalikasan, makatao at makabansa. Oh. 
COVID-19, we have come to have this virtual graduation. Thank you, for you have witnessed and celebrated this kind of graduation. Still, it is a very special day for us, celebrating that we have finished our elementary grades here in Bao Central. We are inspired for joining us in our virtual graduation. To all of us, keep safe in mabuhay tayong lahat. And now, ladies and gentlemen, you're about to witness the highlight of today's event. To do the honors of presenting this school year's candidates for graduation, may we have on our screen our very own school principal, Ma'am Ophelia R. Katura. This will be followed by the acceptance and confirmation by our school's division superintendent, Isagani S. De La Cruz, Ceso 5. 
Flower School Division Superintendent, Isagani S. Lacruz, C. Supide of Cotabato Division. Sir, I have the honor to present to you the graduating class of school year 2020-2021, comprising 61 boys and 57 girls with a total of 180 learners of Bao Central Elementary School. As the principal of this institution, I hereby certify that they have successfully completed all the requirements prescribed by the Department of Education under K-12 Basic Education Curriculum. Sir, they are now ready for your confirmation. By virtue of the authority vested upon me as the school's division superintendent of the school's division of Cotabato and on the basis of the certification of your school head that you have satisfactorily met the curriculum requirements described by the Department of Education under the K-12 Basic Education Curriculum for Elementary. I hereby confirm you as graduates of your school for the school year 2020-2021 effective today. You are now entitled to receive your certificates for graduation. Congratulations! My dear graduates, the moment that you and your parents have been waiting for has finally come. This time, you will finally reap the fruit of your hard work and discipline. You will now receive your prize diploma as a symbol of accomplishment. Here are the Bao Central Elementary School Batch 2021 graduates. From Grade 6 Aguinaldo with their advisor, Mrs. Mitusela C. Cabantog. Anotado James Francis C. Ardilosa Kurt J. G. Bitamor Donnell T. Cabastante Christian Janold A. Gandalia John Lloyd P. Herago Mark Antonio A. Makabansa Grain J. Will J. Osomo Rolando Jr. P. Paulete Marl Jaffet G. Pax Jean Ray B. Samson Raymark B. Ventura Arman Gale S. Sumagang Jenny Boy. Ahmad Shakira Therese R. Sangao Fame A Ambani Frillian C Aiko Rick Josea Freja P Buagas Jaika Leonor C Kabaya Frenzy Clea C Anto Mayor Leon Claire C. Anto Mayor Zian Pearl C. Catalan Richel Q. Housing Jane B. Kaya 
Housing, Risa Jean A. Chavez, Princess Kate T. Galumbines, Raya Joy G. Dimihelio, Kaila Nicole C. Erago, Song, Antoinette A. Erago, Sofia, Antoinette A. Yamal Mohani F. Jorge Mea L. The Senior Richelle Jane A. Magalion Emelu O. Mingao Princess Bien P. Maureen Sherney Nicole P. Nicole Nathalie L. Saison Jessa W. Songkayawon Heart B. And Yano Nicole A. From Grade 6 Bonifacio, with their advisor, Mrs. Marilo D. Flores. Ambani Emmanuel V. Andea John Mark M. Bolina Eduardo III A. Buagas MLZ Dave B. Calambro James C. Catalan Mario R. Dava Ryan Jade D. Hankwa Christian A. Labansa John Samuel A. Bisamin Adrian A. Bisamin Ramon the Third P. Pancho Kent Lloyd C. Panis Mark Gerard S. Pantalion Jared M. Penuela Joffrey. Valdivieso Artemio B. Ventura IKA. Abelo Jamaica I. Venus Hazel Me B. Alemania Lovely Joy. Andresho Natalie Marjorie A. Apirong Ella A. Ka English Bernadette C. Egan Crisilin B. Egan Julia B. Egan Lisa May E. Espartero Grace D. Espartero Jassel P. Flores Mary Grace P. Galvez Eliza A. 
Wal Eljimi. Lamasan Maria D. Macario Janelle T. Manuel Ani B A. Parbakel Angel M. Rodriguez Aryan Joy B. Salde Jenny N. San Diego Sofia Allison M. And Valderrama Krisha L. From Grade 6 Rizal, with their advisor, Mr. Danilo V. Hisura. Aldamar Gijon Jr. C. Aldamar J. L. O. Alido Archie I. Ambani Milanio Jr. C. Apirong Marvin A. Armada Jack C. Batelier Justin M. Berdin Ray N. Boron Jehan M. Kabaya Adilino Jr. T. Canto Mayor Wendell P. Capilio J Boy L. Casas R J P. Catalan Relmar N. Katipay Justin Q. Dialogo Ezekiel O. Dialogo Rekres O. Ichori Prince Roger M. Imperado James Jacob L. Espartero Julius S. Magluyan Christian Paul C. Mantak James M. Manuel Robbins D. Misamin John Mark A. Nikor Jerry Kyle M. Nikor Marjun L. Ulao John Louis. Kimot Rendell C. Siparo Ronello Jr. C. Suyong Jofate N. Laveros Ryan Neal T. Aldamar Janelin C. Bernaldo Joylin N. Bolado Rica Jane B. Dalios Jessa P. Labaria Mary Claire. 
Manuel Rabibs D. Misamin Clearly B. Misamin Nikki Jean M. And Narciso Maria Flor M. Deserving graduates will now be receiving their awards. With highest honors, Aiko Rick Josea Freja P. With high honors, Wagas Jaika Leonor C. Maureen Sherney Nicole P. With honors. Canto Mayor Leon Claire C. Catalan Grichel Q. Yano Nicole A. Yamal Mohani F. Magalion Emelu O. Songkayawon Part B. When hard work and determination work hand in hand, success would really be possible. Graduating with flying colors is an achievement for both pupils and their parents. At this juncture, we will witness Rick Josea Freja P. Aiko with highest honors as she delivers her academic excellence address. To our school's division, Superintendent Isagani S. De La Cruz, CISO 5. To our municipal adopter, Ma'am Jocelyn P. Ordinario. To our district head, Ma'am Daisy J. Fortines. To our energetic principal, Ma'am Ophelia R. Caturas. Teachers, parents, and visitors, good morning to all of us. It is a great honor to speak in this virtual graduation. It is indeed a great challenge to all of us. This school year 2020-2021, because of what this pandemic had brought to us, especially for us learners, here in Bao Central Elementary School. This coronavirus has caused school graduation to be replaced with virtual program. In spite of this, in behalf of the batch 2020-2021, we are happy to come up with this virtual graduation with the team strengthening the quality of education amid the COVID-19 pandemic. The experiences, memories, when things don't go quite as planned like we did in primary grades. Besides, this pandemic helped this class develop our characters studying and mastering new materials, which is difficult enough, but with the help of our amazing teachers of Baal Central, with the added responsibilities more at the house, Challenges that come with being at home, with the family. Thank you for we succeed all of this. Now, as we step forward and start to reach our goals, there will be harder challenges to overcome. But with our willpower, never forget, classmates, that as long as we will be strong, be with our family, we can pursue to succeed. Our family, dear graduates, supported each other through the pains brought of this pandemic and also shifts. Friendship in the hard time with family. This us all together to teach us something about ourselves that we didn't learn before. To our alma mater, we will never forget you. Someday, we will be returning back here with honor and to be proud of what you have started to us. To all of us, thank you and mabuhay tayong lahat. At this point, we will hear inspirational messages from our school's division superintendent, Sagani S. De La Cruz, CESO 5. Our regional director, Carlito D. Rocafort, CESO 5, Director 3. The Department of Education Secretary, Leonor Magdolis Briones.
isang mainit na pagbati ng tagumpay para sa lahat ng mga nangagsipagtapos sa taong panuruan 2020-2021. Ang aking mainit na pagbati ng isang mapagpalang araw sa mga magulang, mga guro, mga pinuno ng mga lokal na pamahalaan, at lahat ng nakikilahok sa palatuntunan ito. Ako ay nagagalak dahil sa kabila ng mapaghamong panahon sa kasalukuyan, ay nagawa ninyong may pagpatuloy ang inyong agikain upang linangin ang inyong kakayahan gamit ang iba't ibang kaparaanan ng pagkatutok. Tayong lahat ay nabigla sa di inaasahang pagbabago sa sistema ng edukasyon Ngunit ako ay lubos na nagpapasalamat dahil sa nagawa nating makatugol sa hamon ng bagong normal. Lubos ang aking paghanga at auspusong pasasalamat sa mga magulang, mga pinuno ng barangay, munisipyo at probinsya, at mga samahang patuloy na nagbibigay ng tulong at tiwala. Kayo po ay naging kasangkapan sa pagpapanatili ng isang makabuluhang karanasan sa pag-aaral ng ating mga kabataan at sa pagbibigay ng matiwasay na kalagayan para matugunan ang kanilang mga pangangailangan. Sa ating mga kapitapitagang mga guro at masigasig na mga pinuno ng mga paralan, ang mga pagpapakasakit na inyong pinagdaanan ay isang patunay na handang-handa ninyong ibinahagi ang lahat ng inyong makakaya para sa ikabubuti at ikatatagumpay ng ating mga mag-aaral. Kayo ay nagsilding gabay ng ating mga mag-aaral upang mapagbuti nila at gamitin sa tamang paraan ang kagalingang bigay sa kanila ng ating buong may kapal. At sa ating mga magigiting na nangagsipagtapos sa taong panuruan 2020-2021, ang aking pagsaludo sa inyong ipinamalas na pagpukunyagi at pagpitsigla. Pati itong kasama sa tagumpay na ito ay ang pangarap ninyong makapagpatuloy na makamit ang mas mataas na antas ng edukasyon. Ibig kong kayo ay paalalahanan na sa inyong patuloy na paglalakbay tungo sa tugatong ng inyong tagumpay, laging pakatandaan ang mga karanasang nagbigay sa inyo ng aral upang magkaroon ng lakas ng loob, katatagan, at simbuyo ng damdamin. Ang mga ito ay magsisilbing ilaw na magbibigay liwana sa inyong katahaking landas tungo sa hinaharap. Sa kabila ng tagumpay na ito, Lagi sana kayong lumingon sa mga taong nakapagbigay ng inspirasyon at pag-asa tungo sa maaliwalas na landas ng buhay at sila'y handugan ng inyong di mapantayang pasasalamat. Tunay ngang ang temang kalidad na edukasyon, lalo po tatagin sa gitna ng pandemya, ay isang kapahayagan ng pagkakaisa, pagtutulungan at pagdadamayan ng bawat individual, mag-aaral, mga guro, mga tagapamahala ng paaralan, mga magulang, mga lider ng lokal na pamahalaan at ang komunidad sa kabuuan na may dedikasyon tungo sa ikalalago ng kalidad na edukasyon sa probinsya ng Cotabato. Ating patuloy na isulong ang sama-samang pagbangon sa kabila ng kinakaharap nating hamon na dala ng pandemya. Kaya-kaya nating maabot ang ating minimiting mataas na antas ng pagkatuto at pagkamit ng kaalaman at kasanayang kakailanganin natin sa pagharap sa bagong normal na pamumuhay. Sa ating mga minamahal na nangagsipagtapos, kasabay ng inyong pagtanggap ng katibayan ng inyong pagtatapos ay aking taimtim sa dalangin na nawa ay magiging tanda na magpapaalala sa mga pangkukusige sakripisyo at kasibagang inyong natutunan 
sa kabila ng matinding hamon sa pag-aaral upang makamit ang inyong minimiti. Huwag ninyong hayaang kayo ay ikupo ng mga pagsubok bagkos gamitin niyo ito upang maging inspirasyon para sa inyong maliwanag na kinabukasan. Sa muli, isang mainit na pagbati ng katagumpayan sa inyong lahat. Pagpalain nawa kayo ng buong may kapat. Alab na pagbati ang ipinaabot sa inyong lahat. Nung nakaraang taon, ang lahat ay nabigla sa pagkakaroon ng pandemya dulot ng COVID-19. Walang sino man ang nakapaghanda na mangyayari ito sa atin. Ang lahat ng bagay noon ay walang kasiguraduhan dahil sa pandemyang ito. Ngunit sa kabila ng lahat ng ito, ay nanatiling handa ang kagawaran ng edukasyon sa pagpapatupad ng Basic Education Learning Continuity Plan upang magpatuloy ang edukasyon sa gitna ng pandemya. Ito ay isang naging napakaabalang taon para sa ating mga guro sa paghahanda ng iba't ibang gagamiting kagamitang panturo at mga pamamaraan ng pagtuturo para sa ating kabataan. Naging bukang bibig ng lahat ang distance learning na naging sentro sa pamamaraan upang maihatid ang edukasyon para sa ating mga kabataan. Sa mga ganitong pagkakataon, ang pagkakaroon ng mabuting pananaw at pagtutulungan ang siya lamang makakatulong upang malampasan natin ang pagsubok na ito. Kaya naman, ngayong araw na ito, ay aking pinasasalamatan ang ating mga guro, mga pinuno ng paaralan, mga supervisor, at mga assistant schools division superintendents, schools division superintendents ng walong sangay dito sa DepEd Sock Sargent sa patuloy na pagsisikap upang magawa ang kanilang mga tungkulin para sa pagpapatupad ng edukasyon in the new normal. Ang hindi matatawarang suporta ng mga stakeholders ang siyang nagpapalakas ng ating loob sa pagbibigay ng dekalidad na edukasyon para sa lahat. At ngayon ngang araw na ito ay ating ipinagdiriwang ang pagtatapos ng mga batang naririto ngayon. Ito ay isa lamang patunay ng tagumpay ng kagawaran ng edukasyon sa patuloy na pagbibigay ng dekalidad na edukasyon sa pamumuno ng ating kalihim, Leonor Magtolis Briones. Sa mga bumubuo ng Class 2021, my warmest congratulations. Ang nakaraang taong panuruan ay nagbigay sa inyo ng kakaibang pagsubok at karanasan. Alam kong hindi ang ganitong klasing pagtatapos ang inyong pinapangarap at ang inyong karanasan ito sa gitna ng pandemya ay nagbigay sa inyo ng kahandaan ng katatagan sa pagharap sa mga hamon sa buhay. Kayaan ninyong ang ganitong uri ng pagtatapos ay maging inspirasyon ng bawat isa na sa gitna ng anumang krisis ay palaging mayroong mga tao na nakahandang tumulong sa inyo at maging daan para sa patuloy ninyong pagtatagumpay. Ngayong natapos na ninyo lahat ng academic requirements, ay madideklara na kayong mga graduates ng inyong mga paaralan. Ito ay hindi lamang inyong tagumpay, kung hindi tagumpay din ng inyong paaralan ng komunidad at ng buong sambayanan. Sa inyong patuloy na pag-abot ng inyong pangarap at tagumpay, kayo ay inaasahang patuloy na makikisa sa ating kagawaran 
sa ating rehiyon ng Sok Sargent upang maipagpatuloy ang ating misyon na nakasaad sa tema ng ating pagdiriwang ngayong graduation 2021 na kalidad ng edukasyon lalong patatagin sa gitna ng pandemya sa pamamagitan ng pagbabahagi ng inyong mga karanasan noong school year 2020-2021. Muli, maligayang pagbati sa inyong pagtatapos. Mabuhay kayong lahat. Mabuhay ang mga kabataang Pilipino. Congratulations everyone! Good day to each and everyone who is uh, attending virtually present at this time of our graduation ceremonies for our beloved and uh, very precious uh, graduates uh, for the school year which ends at this uh, time. First of all, I'd like to greet the parents and family members without whose sacrifices, whose uh, reminders, and whose participation in the learning process for our uh, graduates have resulted in this culmination uh, program. Uh, this year, your role has changed uh, drastically, where we've always thought We've always believed that the matter of educating our children rests nearly exclusively on our teachers and our staff. This time, you parents, you family members, you who are in the households of our learners have expanded your role and contributed to this wonderful day wherein finally, finally, our learners are graduating in this culmination exercise. So congratulations, because this year has not been very easy, has not been a, a picnic for our teachers, for our family members, as well, uh, especially the parents, mothers, fathers, sisters, brothers, and all who have contributed to the uh, achievement of our learners at this time. So, maraming salamat at congratulations, parents and family members. Mas malaki ang role ninyo at this time compared to earlier graduation exercises. Secondly, I would also like to greet our teachers without whose very uh, careful uh, review and careful supervision of the work of our pupils and our learners, this event would not have take, would not be taking place um, at all. And so thank you teachers. Your role has also expanded in addition to seeing to it that the modules are faithfully followed the assignments are correctly uh, implemented and the learners are truly learning and you have had to deal with new ways of assessing the performance also of the learners. So congratulations teachers for enduring, for your patience, for your love for our learners and your willingness to engage in a way and methods of teaching which are different from those which are used to. 
assessment must have been especially difficult for you, especially since you were not able to see most of the time our students in face-to-face -face, uh, meetings. And most of the meetings, of course, were virtual. We'd also like to thank the local government units for their interest, for their cooperation, and for their continuing, continuing uh, contributions to the needs of education, even as our children do not go to school. Your donations of material as well as financial resources at this time are most welcome and your advice has been taken seriously not only by our teachers, by our school officials, but also by our officials in the Department of Education. We continually talk with local government units, especially in times of disaster, in times of great need for classrooms, for space, and for responses to unforeseen emergencies. Thank you, uh, local government uh, units. But of course, most of the congratulatory uh, greetings uh, fall on the deserving uh, graduate. Each and every one of you is truly special. You are different from the other graduates who have passed through the portals of your school. You went to school practically without seeing your teachers, if at all. You went to school with your parents, your mothers, and your fathers hovering over your shoulders and seeing to it that you are able to complete your assignments. You are completing your studies at a time when examinations and assessments are different. You are culminating this uh, long months of, of hard work at this time, uh, even as you have to do family chores, even as you are distracted and even as your world has turned upside down and it seems and it appears as if we don't know what the future holds and what will happen next. But you have persevered and now you are ready to graduate and therefore you deserve each and every bit of congratulations from us in the Department of Education, from your parents and family members, your teachers, from the officials in local government, as well as in the parent teachers associations. You deserve each and every single congratulatory pat on your back, each hug virtually, of course, and each greeting which I am sure you are also receiving virtually. I don't know if uh, you will remember this event many, many years from now. I have tried to recall myself who our graduation speaker was when I finished high school and when I finished uh, my college studies. All I remember is that the graduation speaker was someone important, someone who was invited because that someone is supposed to give a message. What was more important to us graduates at that time was the excitement of the celebrations, the happiness and the joy of our parents, the sadness of parting from our classmates and from our teachers, and the enjoyment of all the graduation events 
that usually take place come commencement day. When I was a college student, we had a series of events which were designed to uh, embed in our minds, which were designed to help us remember and not forget our days in college. We would spend one whole day going around the campus, visiting the classrooms, saying goodbye to our teachers, and sharing our memories. We would have bonfires to say goodbye to each other. We had baccalaureate services where we committed ourselves to God and we prayed for guidance when we go out into the world. So many celebrations and the speaker, of course, is the least important and easily forgotten component of the graduation um, exercise. Nonetheless, I will uh, exert all efforts to share with you what I see are things or issues which a graduate uh, should uh, remember and recall. I have said that you are very special. You are very different. You are pioneering. There has been no other class like your class. There has been no other graduate like you as a graduating student because you are the very first graduate of the blended learning response to education uh, in the Philippines. And so you ask yourself, what awaits you in the world outside? You can either work because the kind of curriculum you survived and underwent as a student will enable you to go to work if you wish to go to work. Some of you will proceed to further studies and this would be a wonderful thing because there are many opportunities for further expanding your knowledge, for further answering and looking for explanations of issues, events that, are, that make you curious, especially in science, in technology, and also uh, in the arts. So you can work, you can go to further uh, studies, and perhaps some of you will settle down, uh, hopefully not too soon, so you can pursue what you really want to do. So today, this is why we call it, we call this exercise a commencement exercise. It's not the end of our studies. It's not the end of all our efforts with blended learning, with modules, with floods, with earthquakes, and of course, with COVID. It's a commencement of doors opening to you. More doors will be open because you are a graduate. You can work, you can proceed for further studies, you can help your parents, and you can perhaps look for opportunities to do what you have always wanted to do, whether at work, whether at advanced studies, whether at learning more in science and technology, in mathematics and in the arts. All of these opportunities are available to you. More doors are being opened. I hope you will select the door which arouses your curiosity, the door which will help you know more about this world, and the door which will allow you to contribute to the development of our country and contribute 
whatever we can to solve our problems and our challenges. Congratulations once more to each and every one of you. Congratulations to you, parents and family members. Congratulations to you, teachers. When I was chair of the board of Silliman University, each time we had graduation ceremonies during the baccalaureate and during commencement itself, I would cry. I would cry because you are sending out into the world a new batch of, of graduates and we want to be sure that what is awaiting them is appropriate. We want to be sure that they are ready for what awaits them when they select which door to open. And so we tell you, go out to the world, do whatever you want to do. God be with you and be sure, be assured that all of us love each and every one of you. Congratulations. Music is the expression of the soul. It moves emotions and fills with the movement of time. Now, ladies and gentlemen, the Bao Central Elementary School graduates in their graduation song. Thank you for 
singing my song. Thank you for sparing a moment, cause with you I feel I really belong. Thank you for keeping me company, thank you for being my friend. And if I pass you cross somewhere, somewhere, I'd like to sing this song again. Thank you.